Hello guys and welcome to our channel Crazy Days. We're here on the 21st floor of our new office. I'm so excited about this place. I mean, just look at this view. I'm not going to stop talking about it for a while, okay? Now that we have the small talk out of the way, today in our program, we're going to show you some crazy tricks with water. Water and heat and some other physical reactions with water and stuff like that, but don't expect me to, to explain to you how it works. I don't know. You want some facts? You go to Wikipedia or something, all right? So you ready to go? I'm ready to show you this. It's crazy. Come on. All right. First, I poured cold water in the container on the right and added some ice. Then, I put a little bit of the water in the can and heat it up. When the water boiled up, I turned the can upside down and put in the ice cold water. The can imploded. Now, if you ask me, that's crazy. In this experiment, I put some water in a clear glass bottle and added some dye for it to look cool, you know. Then, I put a piece of bandage on the top of the bottleneck and secure it with a rubber band. Then, I flip the bottle upside down and guess what? The water remains in the bottle. What's holding the water? That small piece of bandage with the holes the size of the toothpick? I even put some toothpicks through those holes. Toothpicks went up, water didn't come down. I don't know. If this was an open bottle of beer and it didn't come out, I would get a little upset. But that's me. In this experiment, I put some water in the clear plastic bottle then I cut some hats off of those matchsticks and put them inside of the bottle. Then I tighten the cap up and shoot the bottle a little. The hats are floating, right? But when I put some pressure to the bottle, they started to sink. And then when I let go of the bottle, they came up on the top again. This is a simple but interesting experiment. When I put some water in a cold frying pan, it behaved normal, just like it would in any other container. But when I hit the pan up, water kind of rolled up and behaved like it didn't want to stick to the bottom of the pan. Yeah, I couldn't blame it. I wouldn't want to stick to the bottom of that pan either. <laughs> 